Hi, I'm Dr. Asima Pati. I'm a consultant maxillofacial surgeon in Com HTS, Center for Oral Maxillofacial and Hair Transplant Surgery. We have discussed many topics related to the surgical treatment for hair, that is hair transplant surgery. Today, I am here to discuss one of the common non-surgical treatments. Yes, I am going to speak about PRP treatment. I will be discussing with you what is PRP, how does it act, how PRP treatment is performed, how do we do it and in the end, I will be showing the results of some patients who have benefited from the procedure. Along with these, I will also discuss some commonly asked questions related to the therapy. Coming to what is PRP, for that I will have to explain you a little bit about platelets. Platelet is one of the blood elements that flows in the bloodstream as an inactivated form. When it gets activated by wounds or damaged tissues, it form, performs its original functions of blood clotting and wound healing. Now a method that maximizes these abilities by concentrating the platelets and applying it to treatment is called PRP therapy. PRP that is platelet rich plasma therapy is an advanced non-surgical therapeutic procedure to treat hair loss conditions. Through several studies, PRP is defined as an all-natural autologous that is derived from patients or uh, own blood medical procedure performed for, for scalp, skin, hair growth stimulation and wound healing for several oral tissues. Now, what does it contain? Platelet-rich plasma or PRP is basically concentrated blood uh, plasma that contains approximately 3 to 5 times the number of platelets found in normal circulating blood. In addition, it contains various growth factors like platelet-derived growth factor, vascular endothelial growth factor, transforming growth factor and other bioactive proteins that aid in wound healing and hair growth. PRP hair restoration is suitable for both men and women. How does PRP treatment for hair loss work? Activation of the alpha granules of platelets releases numerous proteins including various growth factors as I already discussed. It is hypothesized that these growth factors released from platelets may act on the stem cells in the bulge area of the follicles stimulating the, uh, stimulating the development of new follicles and promoting new vascularization. How PRP hair treatment is performed? The first thing we do is your blood is withdrawn usually from the arm and then it is put in a centrifugal machine. This procedure will separate your blood into three layers platelet poor plasma, platelet rich plasma and red blood cells. That platelet rich plasma is then separated. In our clinic, we use a double spin method to prepare PRP which ensures a significantly higher platelet concentration. Meanwhile, the patient's scalp is prepared. Topical anesthesia is applied on the portion of the scalp where PRP is to be injected. The highly concentrated platelet-rich plasma is then injected into the scalp. At times, injectable local anesthesia might also be given to make the procedure comfortable for the patient. The rich concentration of platelets is now injected into the scalp where hair loss has begun. Is PRP therapy safe to be used? PRP does not pose any danger of allergy, hypersensitivity or foreign body reaction and it is a safe choice for any patient since it involves your own cells. The procedure concentrates the good cells and then injects and then it is injected them directly to the area where it is needed. After the treatment, most people can resume to their work almost immediately. How long does the treatment take? Depending upon the area that needs to be treated, the procedure takes about 45 to 60 minutes. Does the treatment have to be repeated? The need for the treatment to be repeated depends on the requirement of the patient. Also, it can be repeated till the desired result has been obtained. I generally recommend 4 to 8 sessions and maintenance sessions every 3 to 6 uh, months for optimum results. Who is it an ideal candidate for PRP treatment for hair loss? Not everyone is an ideal candidate to undergo this procedure. Patients who have an active infection in the scalp, abnormal platelet function or a low platelet count, anemia, cancer, these point, uh, these uh, uh, conditions can prevent you for, from a PRP therapy. What are the benefits or advantages of PRP treatment? 
the first benefit is that it is a non surgical procedure and it is quite simple to undergo there are multiple injections which is not at all time consuming the whole procedure with multiple injections can last for around 60 to 8 uh, 60 to 90 minutes maximum it is quite safe the results of prp treatment are safe and reliable the next advantage or benefit of the procedure is it is very swift the recovery period of prp therapy for hair loss is very quick the results are very much natural this is all about prp therapy for today if you want to get this treatment done or have any query regarding this therapy contact us at the number given below in the description box uh, this is dr asima pati signing off for today thank you 